Hey friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video tutorial, I will show you how to fix eSports FC26 error code CE108255-1 error. So if you are getting this error on PS5 or you are getting something went wrong with this game or app in eSports FC26 on PS5 console, then without wasting any time, here follow the fixes. First fix is to restart your PS5. So press and hold power button on the console and select power off. Unplug all the wires, wait for a few seconds and press the power button again. It will remove any remaining power and will clear your system cache. Now plug in all the wires and turn on your PlayStation and check if your problem is solved or not. Solution to is to restore license. On your PS5, go to settings, click on users and accounts, scroll down and go to other and go to restore license. Select EA Sports FC26 game and then select restore. Select test to confirm. After this, launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not. Solution 3 is to log out and log in. Log out from your PlayStation Network account. Go to settings, users and account, other, sign out. Wait for few minutes and then log in back. Then launch the game and check. Tip, if you have another secondary account, then log in with that and check if that works or not. Solution 4, switch Wi-Fi frequency. Go to PS5 settings, network, go to settings, set up internet connection, press the options button. In Wi-Fi frequency, switch to either 5 GHz or 2.4 GHz. See which one work for you. Solution 5, disable, enable HDCP. Go to PS5 settings, select system and then choose HDMI tab. Turn off enable HDCP. Now check problem fixed or not. If not, then turn on enable HDCP and then check. Solution 6 Change Console Language Open your PS5 settings and navigate to System. Go to the Language section, then select your current language. Try changing it to English or any other language and then check if your problem is solved or not. Solution 7 Rebuild Database on PS5 So power off your PS5 but don't unplug it from the wall socket. Press and hold power button on your console until you hear two beep sound. Then release the button, your console will boot into safe mode. Now connect your controller to your console with the use of USB cable and then press PS button. Use the D-pad to scroll down and select clear cache and rebuild database. Next select rebuild database, OK. Then launch EA Sports FC26 and check if the problem is solved or not. Solution 8, delete game data and cache. Please take a note, you must back up the save data to prevent unexpected game progress loss. Now go to settings, save data and game slash app settings, select save data PS5 and navigate to console storage, delete, choose EA Sports FC26, then select delete OK. Now restart your console and then launch the game and check. Solution 9 is to change DNS server, open playstation settings and navigate to network, set up internet connection, select your internet type and select your internet connection when prompted, then select custom and choose automatic option for the IP address. Choose do not specify for DSCP hostname. In the DNS settings, choose manual and enter the primary DNS as 8.8.8.8 and secondary DNS type 8.8.4.4. For the proxy server, choose do not use and then you can launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not. If not, then repeat the process and this time in the primary DNS type 1.1.1.1 and in secondary DNS type 1.0.0.1 and hit OK and then launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not. Solution 10 is to reinstall or transfer the game to the SSD. So if you are using a SSD in the expansion slot on your PS5, then reinstall or transfer the EA Sports FC26 game to the SSD and then try to launch the game and see if that helps or not. So I hope by following these fixes, you were easily able to fix this error CE108255-1 error in EA Sports FC26 or something went wrong with this game or app in EA Sports FC26 on PS5 consoles. So that's all for this video. If this video helped you then please like and share this video and also subscribe to my YouTube channel to get the latest updates. Thank you.